Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. I've got a IPA. This is from Iron Monk Brewing Company. It's called The Nine India Pale Ale. It is 6.1% ABV. Um, <clears throat> there's a little story back here. I think it tells about, I don't know, maybe it's the myth of the nine. Let me fix that a little bit. There we go. Okay, it says, In Norse mythology, Agur was a friendly giant that lived with his murderous wife in a great hall under the ocean. In his spare time, he brewed tasty ales and shared them with the gods. In honor of his nine beautiful daughters, we used nine different hop varieties to craft this juicy IPA. We'd like to think it would be a hit with Agur and his buddies. Hmm. Okay, there you go. His murderous wife. How could you get any sleep when you know your wife's a murderer and you could be murdered in your sleep? I don't know. I'd never get a wink of sleep, I tell you. <clears throat> Don't know if there's anything in there, but it might be. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There was a lot of sediment in there. Wow. Oh my goodness sakes, that smells really good. Finger of head, it's uh, a little off-white. Um, <clears throat> got a nice amber appearance, nice and hazy. Oh man, that smells good. That's like, that's probably pretty close to what someone would call a juice bomb. You get, you get orange, you get a, like almost a, like a, a sweet orange. You get maybe a little mango in there. Oh man, all the, those hop varieties is just like each one is complementing each other in the in the way of that it makes it's it's just making the overall aroma of this really good um so i am really anxious to to see what this thing tastes like too all right here we go Man, that is smooth. I'm, I'm almost, <clears throat> I don't know if I would guess that was like an IPA, cause it's, it's, um, it's just really drinkable. The bitterness is like way down, way, way down, way low. I mean, it, there's hardly any at all. It's mostly just a, there's a, there's a nice, um, bready, yeasty kind of uh, of a of a taste going on in there. Um, carbonation is really low. Um, it's it's like it's almost close to what a nitro might be. Um, it's not, I mean, it's kind of like, a, it gives it kind of a flat kind of uh, characteristic to it. Um, but there's still, there's a light carbonation. Um, it's just a little bit of a bitterness on the swallow, on the back end. 
but it's hardly even there. It's just just uh, big flavor forward um, on this thing. Wow, that's good. Oh man. It's a, I mean, this is, this is beyond sessionable. I mean, if you gave this to somebody and they haven't ever had an IPA before, <clears throat> and then they had like a, like a real strong IBU, uh, uh, IPA, <laughs> they, they would like, oh my God, I didn't know they were this bitter because this one's not bitter at all. And if they're expecting it all taste like this and be like this, they would be fooled. Um, so, if you gave someone this and said, this is an IPA, but it's, um, it's a very mild IPA. So, you drink this, kind of get a little bit of a feel, kind of what an IPA is going to be like, but be expecting it to be more bitter next time. More grapefruit. Um, Grapefruit, um, skin, uh, just bitter, you know, bitter that way. So, I, mean, I had a mosquito that he's trying to to get a hold of me there. You guys know what I mean, right? I'm not just rambling and not making any sense. The words that are coming out of my mouth to me are making sense but i don't know if they're being <laughs> received um logical or not but it's really good i like i like a, a little bit more bitter ipa um you know also but every once in a while just these real big flavored you know, IPAs that are just like so mellow are nice, you know, easy drinkers, enjoyable. And it's plus it's 6.1%. 6 wow. It's getting drank too fast. So Iron Monk is out of Stillwater, Oklahoma. Um, so if you're not familiar with Oklahoma, um, you probably probably haven't ran across these. I don't know how far they distribute out. Um, maybe, maybe neighboring states, but I don't know. I'm not sure about that. You'd have to look at their site or something. I feel like that mosquito went in my ear. But yeah, really good. If you can get a hold of this and, and you want to taste a really mellow IPA with a lot of flavor, try this one. Look for the Viking, the Norseman. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting like a sweet orange mango type flavors um, with some you know some breadiness white you know white bread and just on the back end a very 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 light bitterness on the swallow and that's that's about it and I mean, I'm, I'm accidentally drinking it too fast okay well, I'm going to end it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. Um, see you all in the next one.